Hello. So, yeah, this is kind of kind of random that I'm doing. Um, I've decided I'm going to start doing semi-regular um, vlog postings here on my YouTube channel. Nothing really particular, just my thoughts. Um, this is easier <laughs> easier for me than sitting down and writing. Um, I hate my handwriting and I refuse to write and stuff like that. And uh, I just I don't have the I guess patience to sit out sit and type stuff out. So I'm just gonna be doing this. Um, and I hope people watch it. If not, I don't really care. <laughs> um, if you are watching, hello. But yeah, it's just going to be my little chronicle of what's going on in my life, mixed in with various things. If people have topics they want me to talk about. Um, you can always send me messages on Tumblr um, or on here, right on YouTube, and comments and stuff like that if you have questions or things you want me to talk about. By all means, please do so. Um, yeah, today was an interesting day. Today, well, so far, it's only 1.30, <laughs> but so far it's been kind of interesting. Um, I went and took a tour of the new school of radio and television. I'm hoping to enroll there, hopefully for fall semester, um, if not sometime fairly soon. Uh, just today, went down, did a little bit of paperwork, and, um... To a tour of the campus, which is all of three hallways in the state office buildings here in New York. And I mean, it's pretty exciting. Um, for as long as I can remember, people have told me, well, not as long as I can remember, but for the, in the, over the course of the last five years, people have been telling me I have a really nice voice and I should do radio. Blah, blah, fuckity blah. Um, and it's, it was always something I kind of joked about and never really did anything with. I think three or four years ago, me and a friend of mine had discussed doing a podcast about um, local music and trying to get people on to interview, and we never actually followed through with it. I mean, it would have been a lot of fun, but we went our separate ways as friends, so it happens. Life happened. Life got in the way. But yeah, so now I'm kind of branching out into that. Um, it's something that I've always had a little bit of an interest in, and I think it's it's kind of like a mix of doing that and the dream I've had for a long time of doing comedy. And not necessarily just stand-up comedy, but being a comic and a comedian. And I know a lot of comedians either started on radio or ended up on radio and do podcasts and stuff like that. So I feel like it's right now it's probably the most stable, most secure way to kind of get my foot in the door doing that and then maybe branch off from that to do stand-up. Um... Yes, yeah, so that's really exciting. Um, it was very, very nerve-wracking. Um, if you follow me on Tumblr, you know that I have issues with um, bipolar depression and, and severe social anxiety. So it was really, really tough for me to, to get in my car, um, drive down somewhere where I've actually never been. I've never driven around the state office campuses here. and. Um, yeah, I would just the thought of being around that many people that I don't know and not even not even talking to them, just a matter of being near them. It was very strange. Um I have like a little mini freak out in my uh, in my car uh, while I was waiting for my appointment. And yeah, but powered through and went through and did it. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, that's kind of where I'm at now. Um, I'm coming out of a, a little bit of a financial slump. Hopefully, with everything that I've laid out for the next coming two weeks, I should be getting good to go, which is really good because I've been hurting a little bit for that. Um, I actually went back to uh, smoking cigarettes simply because it was slightly less expensive at the time, combined with the fact that most of the stuff that I use when I vape, I have to order. So, I didn't really have time frame-wise where I could go without it. Um, so it was just easier for me to go down to the gas station and pick up a pack of smokes. But, Friday I'm going down and uh, get paid. 
get to go pick up some some more cotton and some more liquid and be right back doing what I do. More or less. I get to get a haircut because my hair is finally, finally long enough to do something with and I am in desperate, desperate need of a trim. I can go back to having nice hair again, which I miss. I'm sure maybe one or two other people might miss it as well. So I used to get a lot of people telling me that they liked my hair. So, yeah. Um, yeah, I'm just going to try and do these vlogs every... I'm going to try and do like once a week. I can't guarantee that anything exciting is going to happen on a week-to-week -week basis for me to talk about. Um, some might be longer, some might be shorter, um, I might do two in one week, depending on if people have requests for stuff they want to see, and, you know, things they want me to talk about, if someone has something pertinent they want me to talk about, or if something happens in the world that I feel necessary to address, I will. Um, also a matter of when I have the time to do it. Uh, not so much to the course of, will I have free time, because I only work part-time, so I have a lot of free time, but it's a matter of when I have the ability to actually sit down, you know, with the peace and quiet I need to plan out a video and actually do it. Um, a lot of the vlog, act, the actual, like, just week-to-week -week updates are pretty much going to be random. Um, not really going to plan them out like this. I didn't, didn't write anything down just kind of turned on my camera and I'm um, just going to talk. And that's probably what the the week-to-week -week ones, the updates will be, even if it's just five, maybe ten minutes. I mean, this one's already only seven minutes long and I'm pretty much done. Um, but yeah, it'll just be me sitting down and kind of babbling. So, yeah, I'm going to try and pretty up my YouTube page a little bit, um, start promoting it a little bit more. Um, you'll see it. I'm going to try and promote it on Instagram as well as on Tumblr. Um, both places you can follow me at Middle Class Reject. Um, I'll probably put links in the description to both uh, my Tumblr and my, um, my Instagram page. And I'm going to try and promote some other places too. Um, I have some friends that have some pretty prominent social media presences, so I'm going to try and con them into helping me out. So, anyway, you guys have that to look forward to, or to not look forward to, or to avoid completely. I don't really know, but this is something I'm doing as kind of like a, uh, like a mental release to, um, yeah, just get my thoughts and stuff like that out there. Hopefully people listen. Maybe it'll resonate with somebody, maybe it won't. Maybe it'll drive people away. Who knows? I am close to 900 um, followers on Tumblr, which is like my main social media kind of thing, which is awesome. <laughs> um, I never thought, I remember when I hit 100 followers and I was like, it was, it was fucking insane. Um, never really thought I'd get much higher than that. The fact that I have blows my mind, and I'm massively thankful for each and every one of you. I know there's people out there with way, way more subscribers and way, way more followers than I have. But, I mean, I don't really do anything. I mean, I just write. Um, I write what's in my head, and people seem to like it. People seem to like knowing that other people like them are out there. Um, and it's the same reason I got into doing it is because I, I was reading other people's um, writings and other people's stories and I was like wow okay yeah so I'm like some people understand and I wanted to do that for other people but yeah so I'm probably gonna wrap this up I'm hitting 10 minute mark and I don't have anything to talk about so hopefully with this additional promotion uh, of my YouTube channel, I'll start seeing an increase in subscribers. Um, I'm probably going to do um, some more like stuff related to vaping. I'm, I'm staring at my collection that's slowly starting to dwindle. Um, I kind of want to get more into that. I fell out of love with it for a little bit simply because everything was going on in my life. Um, I just didn't have the time or the, <laughs> the energy to devote to it. 
like I wanted to. So I'm probably going to get back into that. You'll probably see some of that on the channel. Not necessarily like reviews, but I'll talk about stuff that I've used, stuff that I like, new stuff coming out, and who knows, maybe if I start really getting a handle on my finances, I can actually start picking up new things that come out and start talking about them on here and giving people my impressions. Um, not that there aren't already millions of people doing that, but yeah, so lots to look forward to coming up, both for myself and I guess for you guys, depending on how much you value my opinion on life and the world and shit that happens in it, so till then. Hope you guys have a good day.